Ready. Eglin ready. Air Force Base, Florida is the largest Air Force Base in the world, and it's home to a small, unique fish, the Okaloosa darter. It's an endangered species and can only be found in Eglin streams that run throughout the base. But the Air Force, along with U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service biologists, work together to increase their numbers. Well, I'm getting a little bit bigger every time. There's an ongoing uh, interest in the environment, uh, even more so with things like global warming and the concerns that people have there. And so that makes our mission even that much more important. During the late 1970s, biologists estimated that there were only 10,000 darters left, so they developed and planned ways to restore them. Recently, one project they worked on was reconnecting a stream that runs through one of Eglin's golf courses. We were unable to create an open channel um, stream design here because of the way the, the golf shots land. And so what we had to do was come up with a creative way to add light to a stream situation. They put four skylights across the fairway to naturally light the stream that runs underneath it, helping reestablish parts of the darter population. This has been a successful project. We've had Okaloosa darters colonize nearly all of the habitat that we constructed here. Weather takes its toll on the darters' environment, so teams of engineers, biologists, and geologists help rebuild their habitats. They grade Eglin's dirt roads and plant grass to keep the soil from filling up the streams and smothering the darters. I've been a basic engineer three times, and I've never seen anything like what we're doing here at Eglin. There's a lot of recovery biologists that spend their career watching fish or watching a species go downhill, and I'm lucky enough to see one going in the right direction. Today, biologists estimate the Okaloosa darter population to be around 250,000 and rising. Airman Zach Vaughn, Eglin Air Force Base, Florida.